is Joyce a moderate. And tonight, Garland is also firing back. He writes this, saying it's, quote, deeply disappointing that the House is turning its powers into a, quote, partisan weapon. Either the transcript doesn't match the audio, or the audio is so bad that he doesn't want us to hear it. This is a colossal waste of time, but more importantly, it is dangerous. A fiery debate on the House floor. The resolution is adopted. Ending with House Republicans holding Attorney General Merrick Garland in contempt for refusing to hand over audio tapes of President Biden's interview with Special Counsel Robert Herr in the classified documents case. Republican leadership arguing that Americans deserve to hear for themselves why her did not charge Thanks for watching. Please for subscribe. The president's age and poor memory. They provide critical insight in what that transcript that itself cannot provide. We have to know if the transcript is accurate. Democrats worry the GOP will use the tapes for political warfare in an election year. They're hoping that in the five hours of President Biden's testimony, they can find a mispronounced word or phrase or a brief stammer, which they can then turn into an embarrassing political TV attack ad. They also accuse some Republicans of hypocrisy for not answering subpoenas in the January 6th investigation. I never said I wouldn't testify. I just want to know what the parameters that, that testimony were going to be. Garland warns handing over the tapes would risk future witnesses from cooperating in politically sensitive investigations. And after seeing a rise in threats towards DOJ employees, he wrote this in a Washington Post op-ed. We investigate and prosecute violations of federal law. Nothing more, nothing less. And Shannon, tonight the DOJ is not likely to go after its own boss. House Republicans know that, and that is why Congresswoman Ana Paulina Luna of Florida is vowing to push a vote that, if passed, would allow the House to force the sergeant at arms to go and arrest the Attorney General. Shannon? Okay. I shall not stand on the Hill. Thank you. Now to a Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.